taken from an East County hoarder following complaints from a neighbor. But get this, Tenders reporter Kristen Keogh found out the owner might be able to get them back. Many of these animals are not your typical household pets. In fact, three of them, like this little guy, are wolf hybrids. <coughs> that cute little cry is a welcome sound to this pup's mom. That's a good mama, huh? Lieutenant Jennifer Hill says the wolf mix was found emaciated at a lakeside home. Her pups, both boys, are just a few weeks old. The mom needs to be able to eat to produce milk. These seven exotic Bengal cats didn't have water. Animal service workers compared the contents of their litter boxes to tar. Very loving. And this one has an intense need for affection. Maybe he didn't get a lot of attention. It's hard to say. The cats contracted mites. Four rabbits did too. It will heal, and she's definitely on some really good pain meds and the medication that will take the mites away. One rabbit and a dozen chickens were found dead, but 88 of the birds survived. Two lizards were found so cold, first responders thought they were dead. Somehow they lived without a heat lamp. It makes me feel fantastic that we have an amazing team that we can all work together and get these animals out of the terrible situation they were in and into the loving homes that they deserve. In Benita, I'm Kristen Keogh, 10 News. Now, Kristen tells us the department is still investigating and will decide whether to submit a criminal case against the owner. Since she has a right to a hearing, she could get all of the animals back, but she must pay for rescue costs and continued care.